Mr. Chairman. What purpose is Mr. Roy seek recognition? What, what purpose does Mr. Bishop seek recognition? Uh, strike the last word. Ms. Uh, <clears throat> I thank you, Mr. Chairman. And, uh, you know, Mr. Gates's comments uh, do uh, pose a difficult problem. And I think um, the amendment merits support uh, only if to flush out the full purpose of the majority. That is to say, if, if they, if, to, you know, draw them out as to whether or not this is an apolitical effort. It, it seems to me worse, it's, it's, and I, I think Mr. Gates is nevertheless right, to, to, and, this, and the point about uh, the social media searching that the FBI has undertaken a $27 million contract to do to the point Mr. Gates made about Pegasus and the ability there. Remember that we had the assistant director for cyber here a week ago, I guess it was, maybe two. I think it was last week. And he said that he could offer no information about any new safeguards the, the uh, FBI has adopted since 2017 to ensure that private data stores accessible to the U.S. security state, the FBI and so forth, were not being tapped by private contractors to serve their own purposes, political purposes. So at least if you're going to, if you're prepared to, uh, to bat down any suggestion of political purpose, you would allow it to be even-handed and not only to target uh, extremist movements associated with the right wing, but to recognize that there are many of these. Antifa's not, I mean, I guess the chairman's position continues to be that Antifa is a myth. Um, so I think it does pose difficult problems, but I mean that, uh, boy, this gets more and more complicated and more and more troubling all along. And if we are, and, and this notion of of apparently politicizing the power of federal criminal law enforcement uh, and to provide all these continuing, it's not that we're worried about how we correct abuses that have been going on in the past alone, but they continue to pile on additional capabilities to spy on Americans. And, they're, and they use this terminology. I mean, again, this legislation recently enjoyed bipartisan support because we didn't know that you meant something different by domestic terrorism than we thought you meant. But if you mean school, parents of school children are domestic terrorists and we can't get a clear answer on whether you're going to pursue that or not, uh, the problems get harder to answer. Questions get harder to answer. So I got to support the amendment, but I, I got to say it really serves to, to emphasize that this bill is rotten under the circumstances. So I'll to see whether anybody wants me to yield to them. Apparently, seeing none, I'll yield back. The gentleman yields back. Who else seeks recognition? For what purposes does Mr. Roy seek recognition? Mr. Mr. I'm sorry, Ms. Dean. Sorry. For what purpose does Ms. Dean seek recognition? Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Mr. Roy. Uh, I am... Um, General lady is recognized. I, yes, I move to strike the last word. Uh, I, I speak uh, as opposed to this amendment, and but more importantly, uh, my goal is to redirect us to the importance of this bill uh, and get away from these distracting faux arguments uh, that are putting 